Hi guys, so today we're going to go ahead and make two Middle Eastern side dishes. First we're going to start with a yogurt dip and you're going to need some yogurt. I'm using some Greek yogurt because it is a little bit thicker so try to get like not watery and it has to be savory yogurt so don't get any kind of sweet yogurt. It's supposed to be like salty um, so get plain yogurt and then you just add the cucumbers. I use two whole small cucumbers. They're the Persian cucumbers, but you can use one big one if you want to. Just make sure it's peeled and chopped. And then I use about half a teaspoon of garlic. It's peeled and crushed. Um, so again, that depends on your taste. So if you like more garlic, you put more. If not, then you don't put it at all. You can skip any of these if you don't like it. But uh, I put about one tablespoon of spices. So I put mint and dill. So one tablespoon of mint, one tablespoon of dill, and then salt and pepper for seasoning for taste. Um, you could, again, opt out of these, switch them to different seasonings or spices or whatever you like. So that basically is the yogurt dip. And you can enjoy this um, on the side with either chicken and rice or whatever you want. It's just a little dish that you can even dip your chips in and enjoy. So, hope you enjoy. So the next dish is a salad. It's a cucumber and tomato salad. So I'm using the baby tomatoes. They're like the grape or cherry tomatoes. And you can just cut them in half or in fours, however small you want them. But if you're using big tomatoes, just make sure you chop it up. Um, and then I'm using, again, those Persian cucumbers. And they have a very thin peel to them. That's why I left the peel on so you could leave them on. Uh, just make sure you wash it, obviously. And I just slice them like coins. And um, I went ahead and added some lemon and lime. So one whole lemon, one whole lime. Just make sure to take out the seeds. But I juice them and ready so I can put that on top. Now with this salad, you can also add mint and you can also add dill if you want to. You don't have to. Also, green onions are preferred for some people. But the way I just made this is basically the lemon and um, lime and then salt and pepper for seasoning and then I'm going to go ahead and chop up some fresh cilantro and put it in there and add it to the salad so it's really nice and fresh. Um, so the cilantro I did go ahead and wash it obviously and then I chopped up the whole thing so it's one whole bustle of um, cilantro that you get in a pack. I just chopped it up, took off the stems, just chopped it up as fine as I could and then threw it into the salad and mixed it really well. So since this salad doesn't have any lettuce in it, um, that's why I really like the cilantro to complement it and you mix it together and it just is a really good salad so you can always um, have this again on the side of any kind of dish or just eat it by itself like that but go ahead and mix it really well and there is your cucumber and tomato salad hope you guys enjoy thanks for watching and I'll see you guys real soon bye